G'day and welcome to Ian Luff TV. As you know, we try and do things a little bit differently and today it's no exception. I'm stepping out of my comfort zone of motorsport and high performance driving and I'm moving into the world of music. And we're gonna catch up with a bloke that's gonna absolutely blow your mind. He's gonna somehow, I think, try and teach me how to play the drums or some musical instrument, maybe even sing. But we caught up today with Matt Schlamm, who is the king and the legend of pub rock. Now, Matt Man, I guess you could say, um, fabulous, you're gonna be taking me into your world today. What could I expect in the studio? Lots of rock and roll. Lots of rock and roll. Lots of loud rock and roll. Well, I, 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 I've got to tell you, I'm pretty excited about this because there is a synergy between high performance cars and, and music, and I suppose it's about getting the balance right. Absolutely, yeah. The um, music and driving tend to go hand in hand if it's the right tempo, the right feel, the right, you know, energy. Now, now look, you're really passionate about music. You've been around, you know, for, for some time and all that sort of stuff. I've even got a copy of your, of your new album, you know, Match Lamp and, uh, and uh, what's it called? Bring, Bring it. Bring it. Yep. Bring it. I guess it's yeah, pretty straightforward stuff. Now, I've been privileged to have a listen to this. I reckon it's absolutely amazing music. And uh, like everything else, it's sort of um, got a bunch of guys in there as well. Yeah, yeah, my whole band. Yeah, and tell us about the band. Who are they? Uh, we've got Adam Grecky on guitar. I brought him up from Melbourne. Found him a brilliant player. Um, we've got Fab D'Antoni on drums. He's played around the place and all sorts of... Is like, that like Fab for Fabulous? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Fabulous drummer, yeah. the Fab Man. He so we've got, we got Matt Man and Fab Man, yeah. yeah. And who else? And we've got Pete uh, Uber, Uber Batcher on... Uh, Uber Batcher? Uber Batcher. That sounds like something... I'm still getting his pronunciation right. That sounds like something like out of the Olympics, like a long distance <laughs> jump. Uber, u, Uber jumper. We've just been calling him Pete Uber for now. I think just Ubermeister. Yeah. That's really good. Yeah, the Ubermeister. Now, your background, how did you get started in music? Oh. I was born in it. My family are all, all musicians. Uh, my uncles, John Swan and Jimmy Barnes. Wow. And I've got probably at least half a dozen of my aunties, uncles and relations are all... So you've been brought up around music? music. Yeah. And Absolutely. What made you go down this route of what we call pub rock? It was where I grew up. Um, in the in the seventies and the eighties, it wasn't so it wasn't so hard to have your kids in the pub with you. And my nanny used to run the bar at the Bondi Lifesaver, so a lot of times I was installed up on the end of the bar watching ACDC and Angels and Man, Rose that Tattoo in awesome. the early days. So it was all right. Well, look, why don't we cut to the studio and we'll get in through there and we'll Sounds see what right. the boys are going to do. And uh, and what what are you? I'm a bit nervous. What are you going to do? You're going to sort worry. of it's easy. It's, it's easy. easy. It's easy. easy. I like. Hey, if it, if it was that, hard, we wouldn't be. Don't doing you it. love it when a plan <laughs> comes to you? When someone says it's easy, I know this is going to probably turn to uh, the proverbial poo. But anyway, we'll give it a crack at Ian Love TV. We're on for anything. Let's hit the studio. And here we are, exclusive to Ian Love TV. Match Lamb and the first track should have known. Take it away, boys.
Jeff. I've just come out of the recording studio with none other than Matt Schlam. It's been an absolute privilege, Matt. What I'm going to do, we're going to change tools. You can have the helmet and I'll have the guitar. Sounds great. And let's just see how things work out. But uh, I reckon, mate, um, I can play a tune on this and you can uh, come and drive one of our race cars Rock at Sydney Dragway. Sounds great. Awesome, let's buddy. Thanks so much. Been Cheers. a privilege. Thank you, Matt. Well, Matt, we're here at the Sydney Dragway. I spent some time in the studio, and I've got to tell you, that was absolutely sensational. So uh, we're bringing you out here to the Sydney Dragway to give you a couple of driving lessons. So what are your first impressions? Scared. <laughs> really scared. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, you do have a driver's license, though, don't you? Yeah, yeah, I've had, had one for years, and I've, I've been, I mean, I've been driving for 20 years, but uh, I've never cut loose. I've never... So you've done the reverse park and the hill start for yeah, your license, yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, look, in our driver training business, we're about taking people, I suppose you could say, to another level. I believe doing a reverse park has nothing to do with road safety. So here today, in a closed environment, we're going to take you up a level, just like in music, we're going to raise the bar, and we might take you out of your comfort zone, because I can tell you look a little bit nervous at the moment. <laughs> um, you, you said you were pretty impressed with me in the studio. Yeah, <laughs> well, me well, well, guess what? You're now in my <laughs> studio here at Sydney Dragway. So as we say, when the flag drops, the bullshit stops. Okay. <laughs> One thing I noticed in the studio was that you actually did a lot of warming up to get the voice, I suppose, in tune. What's yep. the reason for that? Oh, you, you go hard without warming up, you're going to hurt something, you're going to break, you're going to mess up. It's, uh, and you do that every time? Yes. Yeah. Okay. First thing I usually do is grab myself by the face, and I'm not I'm not lying here. I grab myself by the face, right? <laughs> and through sort of pursed lips, like a like a raspberry, go through my Show range. Us. Well, give like, us a raspberry. That it is doesn't one. sound like much, but what it yeah. does is it gives you sort of back pressure on the on the vocal cords. So, so that's the warm up. You, yeah, and so otherwise, when you when you open your throat up, if you just give it to it, you're just gonna. It's going to tear muscles and Is that why I had crap. nodules cut off my voice box? Probably because I over revved it. <laughs> you better not over rev the car today. So well, we've seen the warm up. And got, and we, then after that, and then after oh, there's that, more! And then you, then you sort of let it let well, it rip. Give, us so a, give us a bit I'll more. Just give it, do one more. And then you can sort of. Um, yep. Righto. Without breaking anything. Man, <laughs> that is what I call a warm up, man. I'm impressed. So I'm going to get in there. How about we burn some rubber? Give us, give us five. Let's Yo! <laughs> I knew that was coming too. <laughs> now the man's getting style. Boot it! Now this time be closer to the mannequin. Be closer, turn it in. Now, full power, full power, go, go, keep it on, keep it on. Straight it up. That's alright. Come on. Hard work, isn't it? Oh yeah. Bring it round. Power! Come on, more. Straighten it up, straighten it up. Go again, go! And again, go, 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 go! A bit of under, understeer. Got to get the weight back over the front. Back it off. Now we're going to go right round the pole this time. Simi does 360. A doughy. Ah, keep it on. Come on, keep it on. Cut it off. <laughs> <laughs> How good was that? That was awesome. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was incredible. Just fed out of this world. I've never had anything like it in my life. Show us the hands again. Oh, it was like, you did just going nuts. <laughs> Mate, that's adrenaline. That's what you call living in the fast lane. Yeah. Now, how about I show you how I do it? Now I'm really bloody scared. <laughs> you want to be? That's my first day on the job. <laughs> oh, yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> what I meant about throttle control? That was incredible. Amazing. Yeah, look here. Oh, how did you do that? So what are your impressions of going with the laugh man? Come on, give us that a bit of a fantastic. <laughs> but look at look at the rubber mark. Yeah. I mean lucky we're lucky we're sponsored by Yokohama. We'll be hitting you up for some new tires soon, I can see now. <laughs> but listen, we're gonna go down, you can get the guitar out, we'll go down the drag strip and go and burn some more rubber. Sounds good. You up for the challenge? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, give us a real five. Yes, that's the man. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.